Cause scary. <laughs> what did y'all think this was? Y'all thought I wasn't gonna still be cute during quarantine or what? Like, y'all know how your girl is. Get up out the bed and get cute, sis. You can still post pictures. Don't matter if you at the house. You can still be a bad bit in the house. Like quarantine ain't stopping nothing. Do you understand? Like me, man, that's what you like these bitches count up a check in a white tee. Yeah. Bitch, I'm roll running. I don't give a fuck who beside me. Bitch, I'm still the coldest bitch. It don't even matter who bite me. We <laughs> assholes. Totate, I smack a bitch face off. Okay, so this is what we're starting out with, basically, a bit head. I mean, of course, it was in my bonnet or whatever, but a bit head, okay? Um, so I'm starting out with this comb. Y'all know the OG little comb that you can get from the Beauty Plus store. Um, I'm parting it, but the reason why I'm not, like, plucking it and making this part go all the way back and making it look all natural and stuff is because, uh, I mean, at the end of the video, y'all will see that I end up putting it in a half up, half down style. So here I'm just taking my got to be gel and just laying down wherever the lace has lifted. Um, I actually had installed this wig like the day before. But y'all know that gel and this got to be stuff isn't gonna hold down more than overnight. So I just have to relay it in the morning. So in the meantime, this wig was sent to me by Beauty Forever Hair. If you guys would like to go and check them out, I will have all of their details down in the description box. This is their curly wig in 22 inches. The lace is transparent and it is 150% density. Now I'm taking my Motions Wrapping Foam Lotion, I believe that's what it's called, and I'm going to go ahead and relay my edges down. Then I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it with my OG wrap. Like y'all see this video, I mean this wrap in every single video wherever I'm doing my hair or doing like a frontal. So y'all know about this wrap and this lay down your edges by now. <laughs> So here I was just seeing if I wanted to go ahead and put it up and have that half down or if I wanted to do a side flip over whatever but like in the back of my head I just really wanted to do like a middle part with it because I hadn't worn, down, worn it down but it was cute at first when I had it down and it was still poofy because I haven't wet this hair yet. This is actually my first time wetting the hair as you see me on video because when I first installed it I let it just be natural however the wig came so here i'm just gonna actually style it down with the middle part
So as you've seen, I took my spray bottle, which had water in it, and now I'm taking that same Motions um, foaming lotion, and I'm just applying that all throughout the hair. So the Motions Foaming Lotion wasn't giving the hair the look that I wanted. Like I wanted it to be a little bit more weighed down and like more like of the wet look. So I took my Lotta Body Foaming Lotion and this helped it a lot. It's I don't know if it's thicker or what, but the formula in this made it weigh down a little bit more than the Motions did. So I went ahead and used that on that side on top of the Motions, but on this side, I just went ahead and went straight in with a lot of body, a lot of body, a lot of body foam and lotion instead of even wasting my time with the motions. So once I was done applying my foaming lotion to both sides, I went ahead and took the wrap off because by the end, I mean, my edges were pretty much laid and done and set in place. Um, I did go back in and brush them out though. You do want to do that whenever you take your wrap off from laying your edges just to make sure, you know, that they're laying right and in place because sometimes the wrap can like smush them up together. So you just want to brush them out. I also went back in with more foam and lotion because I just really love the wet look. If I'm going for a wet look, I want it to look wet, wet. I don't want it to look damp, okay? But you can add the foam and lotion in for your preference. I just really like mine to look wet.
then I added me a little lip gloss since y'all see my makeup was already done and I'm finna pop my sh period Okay, now let's find the outfit to put on, even though we're gonna be sitting in the house. <laughs> hey y'all, okay, so I know y'all probably last seen me, I think the film cut off like when I was done doing my hair, but I did decide to put it up into half up, half down. I don't know, it's just something about this hair that I just love this style with it. But this is the outfit that I decided to put on. Um, all of these clothes will be um, included in a clothing haul real soon. But it's just a real cute little outfit just to come take some pictures and I paired it up with my um, Gigi Soizos, Air Force Ones, whatever you want to call them or whatever. <laughs> but I just wanted to show you guys my outfit of what I decided to put on. I love this place so much. Like, y'all just don't understand. Like, and I'm so glad because at first I wasn't even going to wear like a purse with this outfit. But... I was like, hmm, maybe this will look cute because I have a lot of more purses coming in and I actually had a purse that like I ordered to actually go with this shirt, but it's just taking too long to come in. So I wasn't going to wear a purse with this outfit, but it turned out really cute. I love it. Let me know if y'all like this little outfit. And this get ready with me because I totally love it. Even though we're in quarantine, you can still go out and get you some fresh air. I decide to go out and get my fresh air when I come out and take my pictures. <laughs> so, yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. And also, make sure that you like and subscribe if you haven't already. So that you can join my faves or whatever. But I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye, my babies.